The refractory period during the puzzle contraction is purely beneficial to us because of uh, the closure of the sodium channels during the depolarization. So depolarization, repolarization showing in this illustration with the time scale on the x-axis and uh, the, the muscle contraction is uh, just superimposed in the single muscle fiber preparation. This electrical response is shown in the y-axis of the skeletal muscle the from resting minus 80 plus 30 millivolts change during the resting phase and during the depolarization phase. So the single muscle fiber twitch of electrical activity and mechanical activity just superimposed in the in this illustration and where we can study the refractory period property of the skeletal and cardiac muscles. The refractory means not responding because during re depolarization the sodium influx the action activity of the sodium channels would not affected with the subsequent stimulus that is what shown here and the blue color indication on the x-axis is showing the point of stimulus green color is the in an absolute refractive period and yellow block on the x-axis showing the relative refractive period where the muscle can respond for the stimulus so in the cardiac muscle, the same electrical activity is superimposed on uh, the mechanical activity in the axis is minus uh, 90 is the resting memory potential of the cardiac muscle potent, uh, the equilibrium potential and the point of stimulus over here. The potential reaches plus 30 in the y axis and uh, the plateau stage and continue up to the uh, the green point is uh, called uh, the absolute refractive period on the x-axis -ax -ax up to the 200 and uh, the completion of the action potential takes around uh, 300 milliseconds where the skeletal muscle up to the 5 milliseconds. So the cardiac muscle activity, the mechanical activity or contractility of the single muscle fiber of the cardiac muscle takes longer duration and uh, the since uh, the electrical activity of the cardiac muscle covers up to the 300 milliseconds uh, about 200 milliseconds of uh, electrical activity is occupied uh, with the plateau stage of the cardiac uh, action potential that's the reason why the the inactive sodium channels would not respond to the subsequent stimulus that's when the cardiac muscle would not undergo the tetanic type of contraction which is not absolutely safe for the cardiac uh, muscle activity the tetanic contraction may be seen in the skeletal muscle because of uh, the refractive period covers only up to two to three milliseconds entire uh, action potential